Hello, my name is Isan Kamardin and today I am going to show you how to animate some cable under Blender using my gravity rope add-on. So without further ado, let's begin. Here is the model that we will use in this tutorial. I have just made some adjustments on the uh, animation speed and I'm ready to download it. Then let's fire up Blender. So I will start by deleting everything and set up my frame rate to 30. The same as the animation we have just downloaded. Next, we can import our model just here, and then, then we ready to go. Next, we are going to add the ropes using the gravity rope add-on. Uh, to add the cable, you need to click. Uh, on the surface of the model, like so, and hit the plus button, and a wire will be added according to the viewport. Also, if the size of the empty is too big for you, you can adjust them under the display tab. Next, I am going to add some more rubs in my scene. Just like before, click in the viewport and then hit the plus button. If we play the animation right now, the tails will stay in place. Uh, so the next step is to parent uh, the the empties to the character, so the um, ropes will be animated with the motion of the character. The easiest way is to hide the character and select uh, the tiles uh, with box selection and select uh, the armature and switch to uh, pose mode and then select the closest bond to the empties and parent them using the bonds method. Okay, then we need to do the same for the other parts. And then go back to object mode. <coughs> now, if you hit play, the tiles we move with the armature and we can bring back our character. And then we can add, maybe then we can add a ground <coughs> at the center. Let's scale it to something like this and add a bit of thickness. Just a small extrusion like that. And we need to apply the transformation and enable and set it to a static collider. I think uh, it's better if we if we add some subdivision also for the wrap to collide on the ground. Next, we can save our scene. <laughs> we'll see very inspired 
and we can simulate the cable to fall. The animation looks already pretty good for me, but there is still some part that can be improved um, by uh, adding collision to the character. So to do that, we need to select our character and in the collision tab, we need to switch it to deform. And we can simulate again to preview the animation. And voila, that's it. What do you think, guys? Actually, at this time, the tutor tutorial is finished, but I am going to give you some additional tips that can help you uh, if you encounter some issue. For example, under the engine tab, you may need to adjust the um, FPS to match your animation. You may also need to adjust the collision offset under the wrap tab and uh, physics settings, then you have the ball collision size. Also, sometimes the rope will penetrate the surface. To fix this, you need to go under the engine tab and uh, give more subframe. And the final tip. If you need the rope to start in a more relaxed shape, you can add more frame to the warm up input here. So the simulation of the rope will start before our, our animation begins. All right, that's it. Uh, let me know if you like this one and see you soon. Bye.